down your neck. There's really no way to describe it other than terrifying. We are completely at the mercy of this animal right now. If he wanted to, he could thrash this predator shield and we'd be his next meal. If the bear charged the predator shield at top speed, there would be roughly 49,000 pounds of pressure hitting us. That's a force we've never tested. The predator shield is holding its weight, and it looks like he's giving up and going back to the more accessible food source. Now you can eat that. See what he did? Yeah. There was no fight. The other bear just vacated the carcass and left. It's clear that size does matter here in Alaska, and hierarchy is distinctly recognized, leaving the biggest and baddest bears to rule these forests. Look at him. Oh, goodness. That is incredible power. Listen to him cracking the ribs on that thing. He's just breaking them up. See what he's doing? It breaks ribs and it opens up the, the food source for exploitation. That sounds kind of grizzly, but it's making it into bite-sized pieces. Bears will not actually eat these rib bones. They're after the marrow inside and the small pieces of flesh attached to them. You see, the little guy here, he doesn't have a chance. He wants that, but he doesn't have a chance. That was the smallest bear in the background. It's not coming in here because it doesn't want any... Yeah, there you go. See how the other bear's running...